Hello and welcome back to Let's Play Crusader Kings 2 with me, Grey Hunter. I'm back from my break, I've had some coffee, and I've given out titles. We still have two more to go though, but I have a new plan for them. My plan is going to be my brother William and his son William. You sir, congratulations, you are now going to be the King of Hungary. Congratulations on your promotion. Cool. So now we get the bonus of having, uh, not that it's really that important right now, but we get extra dynasty prestige for having vassal kings, and we'll get some extra prestige for him being a king. So we get to double dip. Yay, double dipping. Hopefully him and his wife make children. Make babies. So next on the list of things to do, I think, is going to be the Reconquista, because I'd like to form Hispania. That'd be cool. And in a year, I think it's a year, Portugal is going to become de jure the empire, the de Harcourt Empire, because of the renaming shenanigans I did. But that's alright. That'll be fine. So we'll have Francia, de jure Francia, being Portugal, pretty much. But if we can take the rest of it, we can make Hispania, which would be cool. We'd have, what, five empires then? No, four. Although we can actually form one now. We can form the Empire of Carpathia. Or Carpathia. I'm not exactly sure why we can form that. I can only assume that it's because we are the de jure liege of Hungary. So when I hover over this, I get nothing. It just says creating this title would give you prestige and cost you money and piety. Thank you, game, for being descriptive. No biggie. Okay, so first things first, we are going to need to raise our friendly king of Greece's ships. Thank you, sir. Oh, I did some uh, housekeeping as well, so I handed out some education requests, that sort of stuff. And I'd like to upgrade some of our domain as well. Seems we've got all that lovely, lovely, lovely technology. Improve keep six. How long until we can get that? Yeah, a little while. Noble customs, though, that would be useful. Then Tolerance, maybe, next? Definitely Tolerance. Majesty, not so big of a deal. These ones, meh. Legalism, already maxed out. How many points until we can get something good in here? I'd like Siege Equipment. But I'll go for... Hmm. Cavalry? Can I get both of these if I do it now? No, I can only get one. Let us go with... Cavalry. Yeah, Cavalry is a good idea. Okay, so next on our list of things to do is the Reconquista, as I said, but first I'm going to swap out a little bit of stuff here. I haven't really done this before because it's not really something I've found a need to do, but seeing as we're trying to get old Nate killed, we are going to reduce his flank. We're going to give him, hmm, yeah, yeah, about 1500 men, that seems reasonable. We do want him to die, if possible. We're still going to go on suicidal missions. So he's leading a very, very small flank. I should probably have given some of those men to the... Does that move them to the right? To the left? Yes, there we go. Okay. Uh, yeah, perfect. Awesome. That will actually play more of a part, I should think, when... Um, 2.0 comes out. This is recorded the day or two before, I think. Before it comes... Past me, future you. You'll get the idea. Um, I'm not sure when it's going to be uploaded, though, so that could be confusing. Uh, but when that patch comes out, I believe they're reorganizing the way combat works, so this will play more of a part. But we'll get to that later, I suppose. I was going to update to 2.0, but apparently they've been saying that it might break some of the save games, so I'm a little hesitant to do so. You! I can reinforce you, can I not? I can. Okay, we're going to do this hiring first, and then we're going to go look at getting us more, um, more lovely fellows to go in our, uh, in our domain by, um, god, train of thought, by... Upgrading our keeps and barracks, etc, etc. Maybe even some castle villages, though we're making a fair bit of money. We're making a pretty good, pretty good amount. Now, what haven't we got much of? I think we could do with some more pikemen. 
Let's get some more pikes. We'll go up to nine, yep. And then we'll get some of you. And yeah, we'll just fill the rest out with you. Not bad at all. Okay, so how many men have we got here now? About 24,000? 22,500, that's not bad. Let's go. Now, when you arrive over here in Thrace, you should be able to move. Cool. Oh, well, that's not very nice. Sten killing? That, that sounds like a Norwegian thing. Maybe it is. Show me you. Oh, Swedish. Huh, how about that? Uh, he's gathering men for some sort of attack on my territory. That bastard. We'll deal with him later. Okay, cool. We are getting those education requests done. It's mainly to try and convert culture, but also... Ooh, what are you doing? Otto of Brescia. Oh. Okay, we'll uh, have fun. Try not to do anything stupid. I know, hard ask. Uh, we should probably assign some soldiers. So, Leon to that side and Ponce to this side. Excellent. Okay, on board ship. Now then, sail forth into the what? Coast of Asturias. Great. Fantastic. Cool. Uh, the Queen of Navarra. Oh, well, please don't die. Not yet. That would be... That would be very, very bad. Um, the other reason that I'm not forming Carpathia yet, even though we could, is because if you do, after you get a certain amount of titular titles, it decides that you don't have any other titles, and one of those would probably be the Roman Empire, knowing my luck. So I'm going to leave it there until we uh, can reform Rome's political succession law thingies. It'll make sense. High Crown Authority, Primogena. That's when we can do it. There was a message about a king there. Oh, the Lords of Hungary have approved the institution of normal feudal levies. Well, that's fantastic. Pity he doesn't have any men to give me, because we've recently conquered the bloody place. King Roger of Brittany has inherited the Duchy of Ga- Ooh, that's bad. So, it's very imperative that we actually get Rome to the right succession laws quickly, because once we do that, we can... Uh, use the Imperial Administration to revoke duchy titles and give them to somebody else, so that's kind of important, especially when King Roger is ass is assuming power. Oh yeah, I forgot, I um, also started a plot to kill one of the Lord Mayors because he's not of our culture and I don't like it. The roads are not safe anymore. Plus, if I try to kill him and it doesn't work, maybe Nate will die. Now you, can I try killing you again? I know, I'm, I'm so fantastic at it, but can you... No, that one. Please kill me. Okay, this will not help my reputation. 50 piety, I can live with. I want to reign as my Cathar Emperor, damn it. Uh, oh. I keep getting away with it. I'm wondering if that's because I've actually got a good spy master. Maybe I should replace him with a bumbling idiot. That is a thought. Um... Okay, so it didn't work very well. Uh, yes, try and kill him. Actually, how high is his intrigue? Oh, very bad. Well, eye for an eye. Oh, <laughs> you're not meant to die, you idiot. Okay, who's his replacement? A man with magnificent mustachios. And who is also slothful. That's fantastic. Is there anything I actually want from you, though? Any Imperial Reconquests that I'd like? Uh, sort of, I guess. Aleppo? Yeah? Yeah, kinda. Maybe not yet, though. We'll wait on that. I'd also like, uh, not Sinai, Paphagonia? And what's the other one? Anatolia? No, Charsenon, yes? Charsenon. Yeah, we want this area back, so we can, uh, well, hold all of Anatolia, really. That'd be nice. The Timurids also hold stuff that we want, not so nice, but hopefully 
someone here will die and we'll have a big succession crisis. Eh, he could die in battle. That would be nice. Hopefully. Fingers crossed. Now, where are our boats with the Emperor and his merry men? Right there. Alright. Dang! I feel ill. That is a terrible, terrible shame. I don't know what I will do. Okay, we killed him. Those nasty bandits. Curses. Okay, so the King of Greece is not happy that we've raised his men for so long. That's okay. You can have the ships back soon. And Syria, man... You know what, I'm just going to give you that vassal so you don't keep taking his stuff, because really, you're a bit powerful by yourself, so there. Be happy. I was saving it to give to his son, but he kind of forced my hand there. Then no my luck, he'll die in like six months. Uh, what are you good at? You're not really good at anything, so we'll put you into somebody who's kind of a good all-rounder, I guess. Filbert! Yes, he will do fantastically. Actually, speaking of Filbert, how is he doing? You guys having babies yet? Not really. Okay. We'll deal with that later. Uh, Bishop Nigel tells me that Nitra has converted to Catholic faith. Great. That makes me... Oh! Now this makes me happy. Okay. Emperor Nathaniel I has retired from the world at the age of 57. He died after a period of illness. Long live Emperor Raymond I. This is good. This is very good. So we're going to go so be it and then pause. So first things first, we're Cathar. That is a distinct negative. We also don't have a beard. That's another negative. But first, we're gonna fix. Uh, we're gonna fix this. We're gonna convert to the parent religion. It's gonna lower Cathar moral authority. It's gonna reduce our prestige to negatives, but it's going to give us extra piety. And with all the bad stuff that we've got going for us, kind of need that voice of Satan. Not something that people are, you know, kind of okay with. So, convert to parent religion. Great. Now, we are a good Catholic, once more. Though, knowing my luck, the voice of Satan is going to go, Oi. You know, lolladism's cool. But, we're also depressed. Depressed is good, because we can just go, Right, I've had enough of this guy. Off ourselves. It does reduce all our stats, though. Does Possess do anything? No, just kind of a flavor thing. So, what do we got? We've got a holy comment. A holy comet, not holy comment, that's a YouTube thing. Uh, I saw a comet in the sky, it is an omen, if you say so. We've got a heretic friend timer, I have no idea what that is, because it doesn't tell me. And we hear the voice of Satan, so we lose some piety, and the vassals, who are churchmen, really don't like us. Okay. We also hold one county too many, so what have we got that we don't really need? I don't really want to give away hmm I don't really want to give away anything though is the problem I can't give anything to Emma or her husband so what do I own that I don't really want what's not making me all that much money nope I want that I want that too where are you? Okay, you're Amien. I sort of need that. Yeah, I kind of need that. Hmm. Orvieto, maybe? You don't make me a ton of money. I could probably hold on to it, though. I'm one domain size over. That is a problem. And Hermine is forming factions already. Uh, we didn't inherit the claim on Swice or Swiss or whatever it is. Okay. Well. Where are you? You're currently in Mortain. Okay, how do you like me? You don't like me very much, actually. Gavelkind succession? We don't have Gavelkind succession. What are you on about? Now I'm confused. Rome is not our title. It's not our primary title. What do you. God damn it. Okay, first things first. High Crown Authority. We need it. So we're going to go for a vote on that. It's May now, so let's hold a summer fair. 
while it's really cheap. I'd like to hold a feast while it's really cheap, but apparently we can't do that. Uh, we don't have much technology at our disposal. I probably should have kept some of these points. Okay, well, we can work on that later. We have a strong army. That's a good sign. We can probably hold off people. Some people really don't like us, though, but we're kind of safe here. You can't do Jack Diddley Squat. You're our vassal. And, hmm. Have I got anything good in here? Not really. I can't really do anything like that. Hang on, what? Why would I want to kill him? I don't know. Maybe I'm his heir? I don't think so, though. Where's Varangian Guard Man? There he is. Nope. It's Agnatic Open Elective, so I'm not his heir. I'm not anything to him, really. Okay, well, first things first. I need my Spy Master to scheme at home. I need to make sure that everything's all good. You're okay where you are. You need to suppress revolts here as well. You can keep doing what you do. Why do you hate me, by the way? Right, Valoi, I own all the stuff that he wants. He's also ambitious. Fair enough. Um, hmm. You know what? You need to go make the Pope like me. You need to make him love me. So, get over there, increase religious reputation stuff. So, we can use up a title. Mercuria still don't want it, so I'm going to get rid of that. We can create... Obviously the Empire of Carpathia, but we're not going to do that either. We're going to wait, basically. I'm hoping that he'll be an okay ruler, and we'll get some good options, but if not, we can always kill him. Now, how are you doing? You're doing okay, actually. You apparently have a claim on Obino for some reason, I don't know why. And we currently have two children, that's good. If she has a son, that'd be better. But if she just has a kit, that'll be fine. So, let's continue on. Whoa. Pick an ambition. I can. Can I become better at stewardship? I can. Good. Okay, let's try doing that. Because I would love to be able to keep all of my counties. Because I don't really want to give any away. I'm going to slow us down to speed 3 for now. Because there's going to be a lot of factions happening. I'd really like for them to stop. Um, I'm not going to go forward and do what I was going to do. I don't think, unless, how long have I got? Six years. Six years before this drifts as well. Okay. Yeah, I'm just going to park our armies over here. I'm going to park the... How many men do you actually have? I think it's a 23,000 stack. I'm going to park them right over here in Santiago. And hope that's close enough. Uh, yeah, lots and lots and lots of factions. Now, it would probably be wise to kill off our brother, because he has lots of claims on all of our stuff. But he's ill, so he's okay. I'm not going to worry about him. He's got strong claims that'll be passed down to become weak claims. You have got weak claims. They're going to be passed on, but you can't press them. At least not against me. Same with Osmond. Same with... Pretty much all of these people. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, we, we probably don't have much to worry about, and we can crush a rebellion if we have to. I'm okay with crushing a rebellion. It would give our um, current ruler Raymond a bit of props, really. Now, this should help. Augustus is very, very important. If you have Augustus, people like you more, so that should help offset the whole being crazy thing. It's a pity he doesn't have Born in the Purple. You are the current ruler of the glorious Roman Empire. May your reign be a prosperous one. Hail Caesar. Fantastic. Okay. So, let's see how things go. Really? Oh, you have sickness. Well, I should have remembered that. Okay, get over there instead then. Alright, and we'll give Turston his ships back. And hope that we can hold a feast. Okay, come on. The attack weakens. I'm not currently at war. Why am I... Oh, raiders. Okay. That makes sense. Yeah, lots and lots of factions. 
Luckily we haven't got the dangerous factions pop up yet, but I'm certain it's just going to be a little, uh, only a little bit of time. Uh, Matilda is a good name. Yes, that is fine. Yeah. People don't really like us all that much. What with being crazy. Alrighty, an errant monk is disturbing the summer fair by preaching about sins and the end of the world. His drivel is frightening some, but most of the crowd around him is mocking and laughing at him. Well, that's not very nice. He's just another part of the entertainment. Piss off the Prince Archbishop of Lombardy? Yeah. Or kick him out, make the peasants not like me as much. I could afford the piety drop, but I'm not going to go with it. I'm going to kick him out. Because right now... Oh yeah, we're making a positive, obviously, because we've got vassals. Okay, that's good. That's that's a massive plus. So is that. Uh, it was a mistake inviting the jumping Jews of Jerusalem to the summer fair. This again. Uh, I want my money back. Get Roth. No, that's a bad plan. Or the end was fun. No, I want my money back. Uh, if he jokes about me, then he's gone too far because we have the honest trait, that's interesting. That would help, actually. He doesn't like me all that much, but he does like me enough that plus 15 is significant. It was rather funny for extra prestige. Throw him in the prison, or if I pay him more, perhaps he will not joke about me. Give him money, gain prestige. No, we're gonna go with the honest one. I often want this this is a good one. This is our demon talking to us, actually. I have often wondered why I bother about such trivial things. Belfagor keeps urging me to save my energy for when it really matters. We are now slothful. Great. We really need that uh, that increase to our um, stewardship now. This should be fun. I guess we could give away Rome if we wanted to. And just recreate Bedford, but I don't really want to do that. That's uh, that's not really a thing that I would be happy with. I guess we could give away Paris. It's not that big of a deal anymore. Not really. To be quite fair, actually, it's only really been a big deal for the last uh, for the first hundred or so years when it formed a significant bit of our power base. But no, we'll hold on to it for now. I'll hold on to it. Uh, it was great fun. Fantastic. Is anyone actually supporting us in this change? Anyone at all? No. Only our votes. So we need to hold a feast. We do, we do, we do. Um, hmm. Okay, yeah, we sort of need to give stuff away. Uh, how many troops does Army N give us? How many troops do we personally have, actually? 16k. Army N is... Perun, right? Yes. That gives us 1.3k. How many does Paris give us? I still own Paris, don't I? Oh, right. Paris is Maloon. Because Paris is the actual city. Uh, hmm. They're worth it. They're worth holding on to. Damn. Damn it, damn it, damn it. How many troops does Vermandois actually, uh, does Valois actually have? Okay, we'd have to go through that whole thing again. I'm not going to do that. He's my Chancellor. If I raise his troops, I can raise 1,200 men. Okay, so giving him those won't actually make him that much more powerful. I'm going to do it. We're going to hold on to Normandy. We're going to hold on to Rome. And that's pretty much it. So, uh... Oh right, I personally hold them, I have to grant them to him. I will grant you Amien, there you go, and Paris. At long last, Paris has left our personal holdings. There you are. Okay, our Chancellor likes us. That is always a positive thing. It generally helps. Now let's see how much he likes us. Will he flip towards voting for us? No, but there will be a... <laughs> There is a revolt in Philip Philopolis. Philippopolis? Philippopolis. There, that place in Macedon. They have been led by a former soldier. Blast traitors. Um, okay. So we need Greek troops. Wow. 74, really? 
that is fairly impressive. How long have you been king, I wonder? Let's find out. That That's really impressive. He's been king... Oh, he's only been king for six years. Really? I made you king at 70... Like, 66? I'm not entirely sure what I was thinking there. I don't know that I was thinking at all. Alrighty, you... Really? Huh. How about that? That's disturbing. Alright, well, someone will holy war him once he comes of age. Uh, raise the troops. Raise your troops too. We need to crush this rebellion. And... I've already raised yours, haven't I? Yes. We'll grab... King of Serbia's troops too. And we'll have everybody meet right there in Sadika. Allons-y. Okay. So we need to have a feast. We need to have a feast soon. I guess... The positive thing is I can always commit suicide. If I need to. I'd prefer not to. Though ruling as this lady would not actually be that bad. We'll see how things go. I can't actually go on a, uh, on a hunt, could I? Because I have... Yeah, I've got more than one health trait. I've got a health trait, this one. Oh well, we'll see how things go. If we're lucky, things will go okay. You know what? Hell with it. Attack them now. We need to. You will march straight in there too. Oswolf has converted somebody. That That is fantastic. I have no idea who you are, but well done. You've converted a province. Solid effort. Um, I called them together in now own bed. Ermengild, Gild and her lover. She has a lover. Oh hell no! Oh snap! That's that's not nice. Uh, I screamed for her lover to get out and then confronted her in my own bed. Well, in our own bed. Bitch! Can I kill him now? Actually, can I chuck him in prison for having dis? Oh no, I can't. Would have been cool, but no, I'm not allowed to just chuck him in prison for having cuckolded me. That would have been fun. Um, hmm. You need to march there instead, actually. So we need to catch these guys. They're going to here. So will you. The Count of Zaklumia accepted the King of Croatia's peace offer. I'm not sure what he did. Presumably Rebellion. Ah, and there it is. Dissident factions. Yeah, people are not really our biggest fans. But at least we got a get out of jail free card, if we need it. Um, you can just stay there, actually. No, follow. Change my mind. Come on. 6th of November, 23rd of October. If all goes well, we've got him. Got him. Alright, and then follow him up. The Duchess of Galicia has inherited the Duchy of Galicia and other titles from Roland of Galicia. Well done. Uh, Andre of Auvergne is no longer excommunicated. Solid. And you are going to where? Orid. That is good. We have men there already. So hopefully we can get there within a week or two and finish this up so we can hold a damn feast. They're going to get there on the 15th. Come on. Kill them all, please. Okay, that might be enough. No? White piece? What do I get from that? I gain 10 prestige. I'm okay with it. Do it. You need to get over there. You need to disband. Come on. I need to hold this goddamn feast. Anytime. Thank you. Right, great. We currently have independence as a dangerous faction. That's alright. We'll deal with it. Has prestige of at least 100. Bollocks. <laughs> 
we're defeated by not having enough prestige. Alright, sod it. We'll deal with it later. Disband. We will... Well, we could have got prestige by going to war, but I sort of wanted to avoid doing that. Seeing as there's not really much point anymore, we're going to declare our Imperial Reconquest of Castile itself. Go. Attack. Now, I could send us in with the troops, but I'm not going to. It's not worth it. We will wait. Hopefully, if we win a decisive war... Oh, there we go. This is the first time this has happened to us, I believe. After a hundred years of, uh, after a hundred years in the Dahaqua Empire, the Kingdom of Portugal is no longer considered a de jure part of the Empire of Hispania. Hooray! That makes me happy. Okay, so we killed two hundred and forty-two men. Well done, us. 